नमस्ते एवरी वन हेलो वेलकम एवरी वन फॉर द लाइव मेडिटेशन दो आर ज्वाइनिंग इन आई वुड रिकमेंड टेक अ फ्यू डीप ब्रेथ रिलैक्स योर बॉडी मे बी कीप अ ग्लास ऑफ वॉटर एक्स टू यू वेर एवर यू आर टेक दिस मोमेंट just be available to the awareness the energy of this experience usually it's not the technique that we need to master it's not uh some sort of method that we need to master it's most of the time it's the art of being available to what you already have and keeping that uh intention in mind we are going to begin today's session Welcome everyone on the pages I am live on Facebook and Instagram. So today's meditation is focused on something that we all experience every day. But unfortunately the way we experience that is very interesting. I'm talking about thoughts. You must have noticed the uh title of the meditation is no life beyond your thoughts. What does it mean? right now the way we experience life has a lot to do with our thought process if i ask you about happiness sadness success failure you know the ego trips that we have the need to control the uncertainty it's all coming from that information that we have in the thoughts now thoughts are not wrong but the challenge is we start to become our thoughts and in that process we lose our reality what does that mean you know it's something in a uh, spiritual lingo we call the identification process meditation helps us to go from identification to non identification because you know if you are a human being there's a good chance you're playing a lot of roles you know role in the family in the workplace roles in society roles as you're walking on the street those roles are great but imagine if you never take off your mask you will never know who you are knowing life experiencing life beyond thoughts is the most spiritual gift you can give to yourself and i'll share with you why i'm talking about the throat chakra with the thoughts today before we get into throat chakra how many of you have you know uh, gone deeper into understanding the process of bee hives the honey bees if you look at the way this structure their hive it's so amazingly you know built i remember when i used to go to school uh, in india we we would sit in this van who would take us to school like a you know kids van and i was probably uh, fifth or sixth grade we used to stop by at this house who had a huge like a huge bee hive and when i say huge it was at least 3 to 4 3 to 5 feet minimum it was huge and one day you know they they had to paint the whole house so they you know the people who were you know doing the painting they ended up taking away the hive and i saw it super closely and it looked like a colony like a perfect apartment community it never left my mind and i was like this is almost like a human being has you know handmade it this whole thing now that's where something new started to begin in my spiritual journey in my you know internal journey i remember uh looking at this it made me curious about the jungle world and i realized no one in the jungle world is taught to build their you know homes their nest their hives then how come they build the most perfect shelters for themselves you could look at the bee hives you could look at the nest for the birds or the way of the lion maintains you know his pride right how do they do it so well one of the reasons is they become available to what's already there so monkey is not trying to be a lion a lion is not trying to be a bear and a bird is not trying to be a parrot parrot is not trying to be you know a squirrel 
they all are simply being who they are and when you are being available to your existence you start to download information and i am a big believer in downloading that direct information because it has no reference point it has no filters it comes to you as you are supposed to receive it as a human being we build countless barriers in that information sometimes you want to you know uh build a friendship start a business you know connection with someone but your mind has plenty of information about that thing already and when that happens you end up you know stepping away you hold back that creativity you hold back that joy that love of the whole you know experience in this meditation i want you to rem- i want to remind you that if you can start experiencing your life beyond the thoughts you will be at the highest peak of your creativity you know our entire hustle is all about what's my purpose how do i live my purpose you know who am i why am i here uh, what do i do with this you know situation unfolding for me it brings anxiety because we are not being available to what's out there to what's already trying to give us so much information and the reason i want to bring the awareness on the throat chakra today because you know when i say throat chakra maybe your mind will instantly tell you the throat chakra means the chakra of expression how you speak how you express yourself but that's a very tiny you know like aspect of the throat chakra what's majorly beneficial for the throat is that it's the midpoint between the physical dimension and the non-physical the energy below the throat it's all physical energies right the heart the navel it's all physically rooted energies now energy above the throat the third eye the crown it's all non-physical non-dimen other dimensions and that's where the magic is when you come across a guru a teacher a realized being and how they are able to channel the wisdom how they are able to channel the right information for you it's majorly because this midpoint this center is so well you know like aligned the affection the love the trust that the throat chakra needs it's so important a major problem with our cultural conditioning is that we are always suppressed to even express the basic you know fundamental emotions when you want to cry you are told not to cry if you you know like nowadays if you see on social media people are afraid to express their basic you know opinions because even if you say i like this movie there will be 20 people attacking you how dare you like this movie do you even know the director of the movie is such a psychopath do you even know the screenwriter is such a terrible person and you start to become afraid of expressing even little thing you cannot even say i like popcorns because there will be 20 people telling you popcorns are poison and you should not be having it you know i popcorns may not be the healthiest thing hangover 3 may not be the funniest movie but no one should be attacking you threatening you for expressing uh your own fundamental you know emotions because each time you hold back your energy your expression you shrink the energy here and you kind of build a barrier in receiving what's you know waiting to come to you my hope in this meditation is that we become available to that information throat chakra is going to be our major focus on this and those who are watching i would recommend repeat this meditation and even you know sit together and maybe do it with your friends your partners even your you know fellow meditation seekers because these are the people you are expressing your you know highest self or, or you are trying to do that at least right so this is going to be the focus for this meditation and we'll see where it goes let's begin everyone on facebook and on instagram Thank you for being here. Let's begin the meditation. You can close your eyes. 
Keep your palms open. Relax the shoulders. Relax the palms, the legs, the entire body. Breathe in, breathe out. And take this moment to just honor the energy of your place. Wherever you are meditating, send out a gratitude to the energy of your place. Send out gratitude. to all the known and the unknown dimensions of where you are. We are constantly surrounded by so many unknown entities, dimensions, who are helping us, guiding us. In this meditation, we are going to acknowledge them. We are going to let them know that we feel you, we acknowledge you, and we are ready to be guided by you. Breathe, relax, and also take this moment just be available to that awareness, that silence around you. When you witness the silence, there will be sounds coming and going. Witness the sounds, witness the silence, and don't try too hard to concentrate right now. Just relax as you are. Maybe smile a little, maybe offer yourself some warmth. Feel that solitude. Feel the sounds coming and going. Also, witness the body sitting there right now. Witness the comfort and discomfort in the body. Witness the heartbeats. Witness the breathing. Relax. Breathe in, breathe out. And start to become aware of the conscious awareness that you are. Be aware of that inner solitude. Be aware of the conscious energy that you are. This awareness is much more than the body. It's 
evolving it's constantly helping you guiding you and supporting you in every step gently find bring this awareness on the throat the throat chakra is such a sensitive pathway between the physical and the non physical the throat enables the union of the physical and the non physical stay around the throat no rush nothing to fix Breathe. We are going to begin the conscious breathing in just a moment. keeping your awareness around the throat inhale the breath hold it for a moment and exhale inhale With each inhale, you're receiving that awareness. With each exhale, you're releasing that transition, that heaviness you're storing. We'll repeat again. Inhale. Hold. As you're holding, just witness. Watch who you are beyond the body. watch who you are beyond the thoughts coming and going and through the nostrils exhale inhale hold with One more time. Inhale. Hold. And through the nostrils. Exhale. breathe that your pace don't feel the rush to fix anything to calculate 
or analyze anything in this moment. As you are breathing, remind yourself that you are designed to experience life beyond the thoughts. You are designed to live life beyond the lenses of mind. And you are here to eliminate those barriers so that you play the roles but you don't become the roles. That you effortlessly practice non-identification in your day-to-day -day life. Breathe. And as you are breathing, bring the affection, the awareness around your throat. Bring the trust around your throat. Do nothing but simply witness. Breathe effortlessly and observe the breathing coming and going. For those who feel ready and comfortable right now, allow yourself to dive deep in this consciousness. Relax the body. Simply go deeper. As you are going deeper, witness your existence as a consciousness not as the gender you are, not as the roles you play, but simply a stream of consciousness, which is here, there, and everywhere. It's omnipotent, omnipresent. Relax, let go of any control. Gently melt the body, let go. And be in union with the consciousness that you are. As you are diving deep, 
will invite the beauty of the mantra satyam shivam sundaram the truth the beauty and the consciousness that you are the truth the beauty the consciousness expanding in you in this moment Be easy. Be relaxed, and stay receptive to the mantra that will begin. Breathe in, breathe out, and those who wish. you may repeat the mantra after me or simply listen and receive the vibrations of it vam rum nama vam rum nama it's the vibration of the cosmos the perfect frequency to release the barriers and make you available to that life that truth beyond the bounds vam ro nam Remind yourself there is nowhere to go nothing to fix in the moment It's simply a love talk you are having with your awareness Don't bring in any control any demand or any expectations It's a love note to the divine Do it from your heart Vam ru nam. Vam ru nam. Breathe in, breathe out. there are any thoughts stories memories showing up witness them vam ru nam keep your heart open to the wisdom to the guidance to all the healing trying to connect with you trying to unfold through and remember this truth may not align with your expectations or with your script that's running in the mind give yourself the courage and willingness to accept and be guided what you need right now to bloom vam ru nam
왕으로 나와 Breathe in, breathe out. And when you are ready, bring your palms on your eyes. We'll take this moment to receive the one room, the entire consciousness. receive the warmth the healing going deeper in through your hands breathe Relax. Bow down to all the known and the unknown dimensions, unfolding and speaking through you. And those who feel ready, just touch your throat for a moment. Breathe mindfully. Offer your throat the trust, the compassion, and the affection that it deserves. Breathe in, breathe out. You may relax the hands. Take the next few minutes to remain absolute witness. Witness the light, the darkness, the uncomfortable truth, the comfortable warmth, and everything else in between that's showing up for you. Take the next few minutes to be in this meditation without my guidance and simply trusting your awareness and your breathing. Breathe effortlessly and with Continue 
to be in meditation for next few minutes after the video is over.